going on YouTube coach Rob 619 back with another fragrance review um, today I'm reviewing a real popular fragrance a real uh, YouTube community hero I guess you call it um, I definitely found out about this through YouTube through watching the reviews I would never have found out about this had I not seen the video so I'm just giving props to you guys out there you other reviewers YouTube community keep pumping out you know videos about fragrances that you know a lot of people don't know about or would would not have known about had it had they not watched your video so today's fragrance review is Versace the dreamer and um it's, 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 it's weird out of all my fragrances this is probably I got a couple but this is one of the fragrances that I haven't received one compliment on and um I mean that's not a bad thing this is definitely a good fragrance I just bought so many in such a short amount of time that I haven't been able to wear this one enough um, or in the right setting to get a compliment. See, I have a whole philosophy about compliments and your appearance and the setting to get compliments. I don't think it's just wearing something and going outside to get compliments. You have to know the setting. You have to know the environment. You have to know, you know, what kind of scent you should wear to to appeal to people in that in a certain environment but that's a whole nother topic I may make a video on my philosophy about getting compliments but anyway if I can get this as you see man I got all this stuff I barely even take this bottle out the box but this is what it looks like it's a little 1.7 I picked this up at um Ross or Marshall's for uh, $24 $24.99 and um, it's a nice bottle I like this little Medusa, Medusa head or whatever that is on the front um, I mean it's great so I'm gonna jump right into what this smells like um, you know like I said before in my other videos I usually put on colognes out the shower to try, try to test the longevity and see how much you know how how long it lasts or if it can last t till the morning on me and you know so I put this on when I, after I bought it I put it on and my girlfriend as soon as I got out the shower she was like um is that uh you got on Irish Spring and I'm like, no, nah, we don't even have no Irish Spring soap in there. And uh, she's like, you smell like Irish Spring. And um, I said, you know what? It, it might be the cologne I just tried on. You know, you know, smell and see if it's the cologne. And she was like, yes, that smells just like Irish Spring. And so now every time I smell Versace the Dreamer, I associate Irish Spring with it. And actually, guys, it does. If I was to sum it up in one word or two words, Irish Spring. That's exactly what this smells like, like that little bar soap. The, the bar version, not the body wash, but maybe the body wash smells the same. I don't know. But from what I remember when I was a little kid, that green and white bar soap, I used to love the way that smelled. I love the scent of that Irish Spring soap. And that's exactly what this smells like. A bar of Irish Spring soap. It has that powdery vibe to it. It has that soapy vibe. It has that clean and fresh vibe. That's pretty much what I get. Um, and to compare it to something else, uh, prior to my girlfriend giving me that description, I thought it smelled like Lamar Sport. So if you could imagine Lamar making a sport version, a flanker, a sport flanger of Lamar, Versace Dreamer would be it. That that's exactly what it smells like. It smells like a a sportier, uh, lighter, lighter version of Lamar. So I would probably wear Versace in the Dreamer in the day, and I'll probably wear Lamar. You know, at night to the club. The mall is a good club scent. I don't know if other reviewers consider that a club scent, but man, my boy, that's that's the mall is his signature scent. He wears it to the club, and he gets a gang of compliments from women. He gets a whole bunch of women coming up to him and like, man, you smell good. So, I he it works for him. The mall on me, it just it doesn't work with my chemistry or something or my skin because I like the way it smells on him. But I don't like the way it smells on me. It just doesn't smell the same. So that's why I, for an alter alternative for me, was Cuba Gold. Cuba Gold on me smells like um, how Lamar smells on him. Like the good things I like about Lamar on my on my on my friend is what Cuba Gold. I get out of Cuba Gold on my skin. I get all the all the pleasant um, variations of Lamar without the Cuba Gold. You know, and with this Versace the Dreamer, I get that same thing. All the pleasants, all the notes that I do like in Lamar. I get with Versace Dreamer, but I also get a much fresher, cleaner, um, daytime scent. To me out here in my climate, since it's about 75, 80 degrees all year long, I could wear this in the winter. You know, I know most of you guys on the East Coast or in different countries, you wouldn't be able to pull this off um, in those kind of months. But for me, this is perfect spring scent, 75, 80 degrees, 
uh, which is my year-round climate, and um, so I can always wear this. So that's that's what I like to wear it. And um, like I said, I haven't got a compliment from it, but I I do believe this will be a compliment getter. I just have to wear it more. Um, let me see how much juice is in here. And I gotta take it all off the box again to really show you guys. I had this for probably two months, and let's see how much juice is left. I mean, barely. I mean, I barely even got. <laughs> It's still at the, it's still at the at the very top, and that's that's me having this for two months. So I got a you know my collection. I I barely grabbed this bottle, but I'm gonna wear it. Matter of fact, this might be my center of the day. I'm probably gonna put this on today and see if I can get me a compliment out of it because um, it is some good stuff. I do recommend you guys picking this up at Marshall Ross Ross River. You can find it twenty four dollars one point seven. Great, that's great value for the money in my opinion. This this is a pretty good set for twenty four bucks. Um, I would even pay a little bit more for it. So, anyway, guys, that's my take. That's my opinion. And I'm about to see what the ladies say today. But depending on what the ladies say determines what I spray. I'm out.